The jihadist groups which occupied northern Mali and parts of central Mali in 2012 have introduced a form of Islam which calls for the full implementation of Sharia law. Despite the crimes which those groups committed, some communities also saw them as guaranteeing security and equity in the enforcement of justice. The jihadist influence has divided communities and created tensions between the different branches of Islam. <laughs> Against this background, the Centre for Humanitarian Dialogue has been facilitating dialogue between the different branches of Islam in Mali since 2015. 168 religious representatives have consequently been identified and organised into six networks based in Gao, Timbuktu, Mopti, Taudeni, Menaka and Segu. When there is a decay, we are calling the Imam. When there is a marriage, we are calling the Marabou. So all the acts that we put in life as Muslims, we are calling the religious reference. They are Imams, Ulemas or theologians, Quranic teachers, Islamic school teachers or leaders of Islamic associations. Together they have committed to preventing and resolving religious and community conflicts. What does the Quran say about what people do with acts of violence? What does the Quran say about their neighbors? It's all these messages that the leaders of the religious people are together. Network Imam Ali 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 Saya dia tak kacau adun jina ku jina dia. Saya kul kau ada khalaf di kaya do. Ia rafun yang mesti dia. Ia rafia sefa sega. Ia rafi yang dikehendaki Subhanahu Wa Taala. Awan kitab dia. Ia rafi dia. Awan asunna dia. Hari yang mungkin kadang wafu kui. Boleh dia anda cerai. In 2018, religious leaders had the opportunity to engage in discussions with an ulama from Mauritania during a conference on Islamic jurisprudence. هل تقليدك لهذا يحتم عليك البقاء معه دائما دائما؟ the goal for each and every one is to strengthen their knowledge of other schools of Islamic law so they can compare perspectives and recommendations on a variety of topics such as peace and tolerance. Ça nous a permis d'être ensemble et travailler ensemble et ça a beaucoup diminué la haine et de bagarre et de petits problèmes entre les musulmans. With the Center for Humanitarian Dialogue's support, the 168 religious leaders have gradually retaken up their mission to foster social peace. Ces leaders religieux de plus en plus renoncent à la violence et encouragent des messages de cohésion et sont impliqués dans les processus de paix comme médiateur communautaire.